suddenly. It's Dennis winning on that double like a fruit fly on a grip. And the mouth shows it all. Pursed lips from Mrs. Lure as Dennis goes for the match with the next nine to twelve dogs. My first lips. John's mouth the signs of the small mouth rub in the famous story. You don't see many of them about. There's that shot again, showing the precision. Showing, ooh, perfect example of the 16th of an inch arc. Two perfect examples. Sixty makes life interesting here. 140 makes it even more interesting. 100. Yes, another 140 from Owens would leave him on 162. But there's nothing you can do about it. He'd be satisfied with a 140. Couldn't get one, too. Infinite. Oh, oh, oh. Just been Wonderful to watch. From whichever angle. Sensational game. And you'll never see better shots illustrating the daughter's accuracy. Again, fantastic. Oh, oh, change of mood down there. Change of mood. Well, should be 12 all soon. Barring a little floor from low, because I think at this stage, it's what it could be. Remember, Evans, just one more leg for victory. Low needs 24 to stay in the contest. <laughs> Well Jumping in a seat now, Karen, when she was sitting there Thank like a little nail on Christmas Eve skint about three minutes ago. Must be one by two clear legs and will continue until one player achieves that lead. Freddie Williams uh, tells them all. The players know it and if they didn't know out there, well, I doubt they know this game. You've got to win now by two clear legs. You have to anyway, but at this stage, it's first to 13 normally when it's best to 25. But not today, folks, here on the stage now. Second Three times time. world champion John Lure. 100. Going against number four seed. The talented Dennis Evans. Just looking, third time in fact we've gone beyond the distance. Alan Warner yep. in the first round had an 11-9 victory over Les Fitton. Uh, of course in the old best of 19. Yep. And uh, we also had of course that memorable match when Bob Anderson beat a manly 17-15. Well, I did say, yeah, you did too, that it could be a slip or a flash, a flash of brilliance very late in the game. Here we are, waiting for the flash. Oh, the slip. It just takes one by either player. And, and you know, Sid, there has hardly, hardly been a slip since that 14th leg of the uh, game. That was the leg when they both struggled on the double. It was the scrappiest leg probably of the tournament so far, and it's been followed since by some of the most ridiculous accuracy. That you could wish for. 94 average to low plays, 92 to Dennis. It was as if that leg itself had been responsible for shaking both of these two back two into action. Two go ahead, two sixes now. And again, they're just very quick. Maybe too quick. Yeah. Low chance to go ahead then. So if you have pieces of cotton wool, put them in your lugs in case low support has give it vocal now. Every chance of that's going to happen, he wants two fours. To go ahead. Still a chance, two fours. And knowing that he's throwing first. Purposefully, he walks away. And just as purposefully, he will walk up 
to the hockey now. Throwing for... We've said now through this contest, this is one that John Lowe wants. I can't remember him being as hungry as this, as hungry as this for a long time, Sid. The forward is Lobo. Nobody gets hungrier than a wolf in the Winter Gardens. The wolf from Derbyshire in winter? Perfect scenario. The Lobo step in and make the last eight in about 10 dots time. Uh, finding the true mark. A simple 100. slip by Ovens. Double 12 didn't go in. Double 6 didn't go in. John Lowe stepped in and now throwing for the match. And a place in the quarterfinals and a match with Ronnie Baxter. I wouldn't say that Lowe has wanted this match more than Ovens, and it's far from one yet but he has been as hungry for this as anything I've seen for a long, long time. Absolutely. Well, I've seen him win all his three world titles, and this is that mask where the stone face epithet came from is the mood. It's like when Steve Davis walks the table and Bula Snuka with a march, and the mask. Lowe would like to do it with these three here. And a cracker. Surely he can't do it. Chopper 17. Oh, he can. He can, he can, he can. He wants the bull to rock the joint. Oh, that would have ended the contest. But he'll still come back for 25 because Ovens is way back himself. And he's got to get a treble to pressure. He didn't. So what's the cushion? Well, look at that. That's a hell of an ask to be sitting behind you. That must take away any kind of gremlin from the thrower when he wants just nine double eight. Big nine never was going to be a problem. Ooh. Inside half. Opponent on a massive score. 